Hey, you guys. So no late night live stream tonight. Um, however, we're going to go live twice tomorrow, once in the afternoon and again at midnight. So right now we're going to cover Foodie Beauty's community post from an hour ago. I don't want to say that incorrectly. So it says, good morning, Beezers. Hi, so it's morning here in Kuwait and it's a new day. My mental health is good today. And my mood is well because I woke up and made an effort to think positively and also said a prayer of gratitude. This gave me some motivation to get out of bed and start my day because I've discovered that when I'm grateful for life and what I have, I don't want to waste my time in negative feelings. Life is a gift. Life is a test. I texted my husband. You forgot the word fake before that, foodie. I texted my fake husband, I corrected it for you, to let him know that when he wakes and finds me not in bed, anyone else kind of panic when you wake after your significant other gets up because it takes you a few moments to realize your existence again? LOL. Yeah, but I don't have an imaginary person next to me in bed when that happens. I call it breakfast bewilderment. I let him know I'm cleaning and that if he hears a ruckus, it's not World War III, but just me cleaning. Uh-huh. Is she okay? Like, is she okay? What even is this post? I started by loading the washing machine to do laundry. I cleaned out the fridge. It really needed it. Lots of near-empty Majboo's containers of takeout passed. Haram, we really try not to waste food. Fridge is clean. I rearranged the tea shelf and washed the dishes. I always leave them to dry, though. Do you guys dry your dishes ASAP or do you leave them to dry like I do? So, washer is going and kitchen is clean. Er. I boiled an egg for Harami Harry, my hamster, and cut up some lettuce and apple to meal prep for his chubby chubby tummy moo. I made a hot cup of cardamom tea with honey. Did I say that wrong? I made a hot cup of cardamom tea with honey and planned our day together. By the way, you can see parts of our lives on our couples channel link is in the description. Now I'm sitting, enjoying me tea, and writing in my diary. Um, mash I don't want to say it wrong. Mashallah, masalam, bye. All right, let's get to these comments. Rachel Tania said, you clearly have way too much time on your hands. Why not use it to look up these words you're using as part of your latest identity and find out what they mean and how they're used? You're not going to be impressing an Arab or Muslim audience with this horrific butchery of language. Also, stop with your flowery nonsense. We all know you woke up surrounded by empty takeout containers with the buzzing of flies everywhere and had to text your not-husband to find out where he was. Go back to sharding on camera. Stick to what you know. I'm liking that comment. Um, Nina told her, I don't think you understand the meaning of mashallah. Mashallah? You guys can correct me in the comments. Um, Mad Max said, your diary, get the F out with this fake nonsense. You don't even own one. Missy Moo said, Missy Manson, I'm sorry. I'm heading to bed after night shift in an hour. Just finished a cheese whiz, cheese whiz English muffin. Mmm. I dry and put away the dishes only because I'm fussy about Clara counters, but everyone else here leaves them to dry. I got this cool dish rack that goes over the top of our sink, and it holds a lot. Okay, <laughs> the replies are gone. Um, Hatter House said, good morning. I hope the rest of your day goes just as wonderful. As for the dishes, the dishwasher does the work. Lex said, I read this in the low BMI voice. <laughs> Girls have said, yes, new energy. We love a fresh life redo. The Black's Chaos said, good morning. I'm going to bed, but happy you're doing these things. I love to start my day by making a cup of tea, then getting out of that fog and starting the day. I have to get my kids ready for school and their lunches, but after that, I do get to have finally have a second to chill and pray, and my husband and I pray before he goes to work. Tracy said, Good morning, Chantal. I'm fixing to go to sleep. I hope you have a blessed day. User 410 said, Good for you, girl. Fern said, WTF, I know. What the F? Zita said that, and um, M said exactly. Um, La V said, good morning. California is going to bed, 10.30 p.m. Keep well and positive. Good night. 
Well, this part of California, at least in my in my house, I'm not going to bed. Um, Savage Keyboard said, hi. All right, you guys, I am going to go look on Twitter because there was an interesting Nader update and what he was doing on camera. So I will see you in the next clip. Okay, I have to censor some words here, but I found all of this on Twitter. So Whiplash, and I retweeted it. Whiplash at the Whiplash on Twitter said, Dear at Team YouTube, Nader El Shami is clearly smoking a substance on his stream. This community has been reporting, tagging you, whilst this criminal who no less received a something job live on your platform, he still has a channel. What will it take? No bots, please. Um, and so they actually, I retweeted their retweet. <laughs> That's confusing. Of meandering thoughts who said, Better pictures from Kiwi Farms. Yes, Nader is definitely smoking a substance or another substance on live stream on YouTube. At Team YouTube, that's against terms of service, right? How many more times can Nader El Shami break terms of service before YouTube steps in and terminates his channel? Now, if you're in recovery or you know somebody, you're close to somebody in recovery, if you know, you know. We're just going to show that. And then um, I believe there's a clip of him doing it that we're going to get to. And also a clip of Foodie Beauty talking about him doing that. So I will see you there. Hey, you guys. So Shenanigans on Twitter at Shenanigans6 has this clip at Team YouTube at YouTube at YouTube Creators, this creator, Nader El Shami, man in blue shirt, was live on your platform smoking a substance out of a, we'll say, tobacco pipe. Not the kind used for marijuana, if you know what I mean. This is not his first terms of service violation. We're going to check this out. So you guys look in the background. Focus on the background. Bye, morning. We don't time. spend the whole night because of you. We have important people to talk with. So, you can see that you, are, you, you have place there. You don't have place between us. <clears throat> we have the wrong place for you. You style. He can't argue it either because the way he's holding it, if you know, you know. Right? Your style match there. What did she put? Did she put anything before she retracted it? Look at, he's ducking, so we can't see. He thinks he's getting away with it. We could see you in the background. Doing, if that's the shape people start doing. Look at the way he's holding it. Make up fake stories. <clears throat> Look at, there's no denying it. There's always someone trying to push a false narrative. You see it every day. Yeah. I want to see. to privacy when you put your life out there on YouTube. That's BS. Using the stove to light it, might I add. That's BS. So every single person, millions of people that are on YouTube are not entitled to the privacy. Is that what I'm hearing? Come on. <coughs> the call. Ridiculous. Morning star, go back to bed. So this clip is from Meandering Thoughts. It says, clip from Kiwi Farms. Chantel describes Nader's tobacco pipe, and that's exactly what we see in the pictures. Check my tweet from a couple of minutes ago with the pics. Hashtag Nader El Shami. Hashtag Foodie Beauty. You have to... Let me start it over. He said that somebody left a pipe at his house. It was like a glass tube with a circle which we just saw him using and smoking, which if you know, you know what it is. Oh. There was like stuff in it I could see, like leftover shit. I don't know what it was. He said it was meth. And he said this, if, you, if I ever see you, ask me for it again. 
I will be so mad at you. <clears throat> I'll never let you do this again. You have to promise never to do it again. Wow. Blah, 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 blah. He said that somebody left a pipe at his house. It was like a glass tube with a circle. And there was like stuff in it I could see, like leftover shit. I don't know what it was. He said it was meth. And he said this, if, you, if I ever see you, ask me for it again. I will be so mad at you. <clears throat> I'll never let you do this again. You have to promise never to do it again. Blah, 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 blah. And this person is still on YouTube, still has a platform on YouTube, still gets away with doing this in videos. Like, what's it going to take? Anyways, you guys, let's talk about this down in the comment section. Again, I'm not doing a late night stream tonight. Um, or I guess this morning it would be. Uh, we'll do it again tomorrow. Um, I hope you guys are having a great day, great evening, wherever you are. But shake off any bad vibes or negativity. Shake, 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 shake. And I will see you so soon. Bye.